Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about the um, chain attacks, right? This is one of those mechanics that we um, receive an explanation about how it works at the start of the game, but they don't really let us know exactly how it works and how good it actually is, right? Chain um, attacks is just pretty much attacking an enemy consecutively to accumulate um, and a specific number of attacks and then when we attack with a specific ability or you know when the last character to attack is going to be taking in consideration the previous uh, number of attacks to increase the damage uh, by a specific percentage right so what I'm going to be showing you today is pretty much how it works how much it actually increases and you know if it is actually so a mechanic that you should be taking advantage of or if it is not um, when it comes to chain damage, I'm going to be going here with versus this guy to verify, right? All of my characters don't have any gear, so it's, you know, just to make sure that I don't kill the enemy, right? Um, so that you guys can see actually how the chain damage works. So, let us do a simple demonstration first with the ability for Justia. This ability has true damage, which means that it always should be dealing, dealing a fixed amount of damage. And the fifth amount of damage that this ability should be dealing, um, taking in consideration my current stats, is 1,154. That's the initial amount or the total amount that I should be able to deal, right? But if I attack the enemy, you are going to notice that it is not like that. Your attack was indeed 1,154, but my second attack was actually 1,269 and my third attack was 1,384. So wait, what is happening here? It was supposed to be 1,154 every time. But instead we notice that after I attack the first time I'm already accumulating the chain attacks and then my second attack is already benefiting from the previous one, right? And then is receiving an increase of 9.96%, right? And then my third attack comes in and is also benefiting from the uh, previous two attacks, right? Which results in an increase of, okay, the last attack was 1,384 resulting on an increase of 9.06%. So going from that point, what I'm going to be doing is that I'm going to simulate that I have already done those three attacks just by attacking once with a basic attack with these first characters and then attacking again with the ability so that we can know exactly how much damage it goes up. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and prepare this. And here we go. I'm going to be accelerating this so we can see this faster. And then just you now. Uh, 1,500, 1,615, and 1,731. Um, okay. So now we see, you know, that the damage has continued to increase. So um, previously, when we used the ability three times, the last attack was able to deal 1,384 damage, but then uh, now, since we already had those three attacks completed, what we are doing is that we are dealing uh, 1,500 attack with the fourth attack, sorry, 1,500 damage with the fourth attack, right? Or, in other words, having uh, three chains already in the enemy, we have an increase of 8.38% damage, and then with the fifth attack, we are instead doing um, 1,615, which means an increase of 7.66%. And then the last attack is dealing 1,731, um, which is going to result in an increase of 7.18%. Um, if we calculate this from the start, so, so far we are only calculating with six, uh, pretty much five, because the first one would not count, right? Five um, chain attacks. We started at 1,154, 
and we are ending on 1731 which means that with five attacks we are getting an increase of 50 percent so we're able to we're able to deal 50 percent more damage which is going to be pretty much the same if, if we do it like this for example um, I'm going to be using this character that already is going to be able to do five attacks and then after that I attack with Justia I will be able to see what would happen then That's going to be 1,731. Wait, 1,731 is the one that we already knew, right? Yeah. So I need to uh, double check this. Yeah, of course, because we need actually we need actually six attacks instead. So let me just do it like this. I didn't tie it. Sorry, guys. Let me just do it again. Okay, now well, let me let me just do something more like a specific because what I'm going to be doing is that I'm going to be accumulating uh, ten attacks here. Just make sure that I have everything, and then after that, I'm going to be using my ability to see how much damage I can do after ten chains. I think it was like 2380. 2000. Wait a minute. It's just going too fast, and I was not able to see how much damage it actually did. Two thousand three hundred eight. Huh? All right, so two thousand three hundred eight. That's after ten attacks. So we know that the first attack is one thousand one hundred fifty four, and then the next uh, the attack after ten attacks is going to be two thousand three hundred and eight. So that's going to be a total increase of a hundred percent. So pretty much every five attacks, we are having an increase of fifty percent more damage. So every 10 attacks, we're able to deal 100% more damage, so double the amount of damage that we did initially. And um, we can assume that if we continue going like that, it is going to be continuing to be an increase of 50% every five attacks. So pretty much guys, now you know exactly how it works. If at some point you need to run some calculations on how to kill a specific enemy, and probably you're not able to one shot it, now you know that if you do five uh, chain attacks before you attack with the character that you have then you're going to be able to pretty much uh, do five uh, 50 percent more damage and if you do 10 uh, chain attacks then you know that you're going to be able to deal double the amount of damage that you normally would deal with your character so yeah here you go guys um it's just pretty simple um i think that i mean I uh, was very clear. I'm hoping that you guys were able to understand everything. If you are liking the content that I'm creating, please consider subscribing to the channel, giving, leave, uh, leaving a like, and maybe you know leaving a comment in um, in the comment section, right? If you have any more questions or if there is anything that you think that I was um, probably mistaken or yeah, maybe I didn't run my calculations right, just let me know. I mean, um, I made mistakes. <laughs> I I don't consider myself to be like all knowing regarding this game but i kind of feel like i have a little bit of understanding about how the game works and how the mechanics works as well so i'm hoping that this was something that was you know clear enough thank you so much guys for being in the channel and see you in the next one peace